Good morning guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're starting off the day with something fun and interesting. If you've been following the journey of this house, you would have seen that from the moment that we got the keys, right up until this point, get you guys straight, let's get the camera straight. Hope you're doing well, welcome to the vlog. Yeah, this place has gone through a huge transformation, mainly thanks to Lucy, who put blood, sweat and tears into transforming this place from what it was into what it is now. So now that we're at a place where we've got new flooring, freshly painted walls, freshly plastered walls, a few pieces of key furniture like the sofa, like the table that we're sat at now, we can start to slowly think about some more pieces, some more items for this house. Now we normally have in the past bought everything new and firstly that's expensive, secondly it's not too great for the environment probably, bringing more furniture into the world that is gonna just eventually in five, ten years be thrown out again. And thirdly, it's a, it feels a little bit cold and boring to sometimes go and buy brand new furniture. Don't get me wrong, we definitely do that and we definitely will be doing that again. But for a few pieces, we had a look on Facebook Marketplace and it is amazing what people are wanting to get rid of. So this morning we have found a bookshelf. It's massive and it's free. Free, yeah, they don't want any money for it. They just need us to pick it up. I'm just gonna move Coda's high chair. And we think it's gonna go in this area here. So I just need to quickly measure to see if it will fit. So the bookshelf is 90, 97 centimeters, I think. 197 centimeters. So that is there. It is tall. Is it gonna? Yeah, perfect. So it will come up to about, come up to about this point. So that is this morning's mission. However, do you have a slight issue because both of our cars, the BMW Estate, no way it's gonna fit in there. Even the Range Rover, the length of the boot is only 180, I Googled yesterday. So we need one thing, we need one thing only. We need actually two things. We need a dad with a Volvo Estate. Thankfully I have both. Okay, cool, see you in a second. Okay, we're on. Luckily my dad lives literally around the corner, so it's super handy. I just gave him a call and he's always up for a challenge. It's actually so nice. That's one thing we love about now that we live in England, having our family so close by. My parents popped over yesterday, they had a little gift for Coda, and it's just so easy. It's just so easy to spend time with family now. Hello. How are you? Just the man for the Here job. There we go, yes, bring in the big guns. <laughs> Do you think it'll fit? No. It'll have to. Volvo never lets you yeah. down. Yeah, it'll have Her to. Face. I don't think technically it fits. Friends. I don't think on paper it fits. It's like when you measure the down. Volvo and the furniture, so I don't think on paper it fits. We're just being stupidly <laughs> optimistic. But you can maybe figure something out. I'm sure you, you can figure something out. Yeah. <laughs> V70 never lets you down. Yeah. V50 never let me down. <laughs> V40, okay, I'll give it to you, but uh, I think V70 was safe. <laughs> this vlog is not sponsored by Volvo. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. So we have <laughs> come to there. So awesome. Got a little bit of room. Perfect. You might be right. We can squeeze put in. The seats forward. Do you have any ropes or anything in case it doesn't fit? Uh, no. <laughs> no. But it'll be fine. Okay. <laughs> okay. It is bigger than it looked. Let's put it. It really is a test. <laughs> if we put it in the other way. <laughs> okay, so we're in, but put our seats right forward. So the bookshelf is in. We now gotta see if we can get in. I knew the V70 wouldn't let us down. It's in. It's in. The question is, can we get in? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Awesome. Lovely. Uh, but can, can you? Can I drive? Let's Hold see. On. Let's see if I can. Uh... Well, let's see if we can push it back. Oh, there you go. Got another two inches. I got loads of room now. Look at that. Another six almost. Yeah, perfect. Oh, it's luxury. <laughs> I'm in! Yeah! <laughs> awesome. All right. Right and removals at your service. Perfect. <laughs> Classic. Let's go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm glad it's only... I'm glad, I'm glad it's only Horsham, yeah. not eSports. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, Jack. You, oh. oh, you have got acres of space. Yeah. Acres. Hey. There you go. <laughs> Sorted. Awesome. All closed. Yes. <laughs> Sweet as. Oh, right. oh, I've got to get my key out. <laughs> oh, this is tight. Oh, we run this. this is very oh, tight. Whoops. Oh, oh. What was that? What's that? Oh, the boot opened. <laughs> the boot opened. How did it do that? Hold on. I pushed on it. 
Oh no. Right, here we go. Right, plan B. <laughs> We've got to rethink this. But oh. we're in, we're in. <laughs> we will press the boot release button with my knee yeah. because I'm so squashed up here in the front. <laughs> That's at awesome. Least, at least we weren't Absolutely. driving away already. No, exactly, my word. You imagine, I'm glad that happened because yeah. if it happened when we were driving <laughs> and the, uh, <laughs> the, the whole oh, the bookshelf Shelf. rolls out into the street oh, and then God. gets covered by a yeah. cement mixer. <laughs> <laughs> Lucy would not be happy. Talk about flat pack. <laughs> That's quite funny. My knee also hit the petrol flap release. <laughs> so the petrol flap is, we can fill up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my word. Right. Now I've got two inches. I can go back there. Oh, shoe horny. <laughs> oh my word. Hold on. <laughs> we should have bought my mum because my mum's quite short. Yeah. And she could have um, actually <laughs> fit in. <laughs> I knew the Volvo wouldn't let us down. There we go. We're in. Oh, we are oh in. it opened again. No, I touched it again. Did it? <laughs> I think you did it again. Hold Do you want me, let me go. Let me yeah, go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me go. I'm trying to get my key out now. Get the key out of the pocket. Oh, well, where are these tight jeans? <laughs> Levi straps. Here we yes. go. Yes. <sighs> All right, we're away. Here we are. Right. Perfect. Success. Right, here we go. Throttle up. Lovely. Super. Beautiful. Right, here we are. Right, <laughs> lovely day for it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to hit the road now. The sun has come out, so we're getting a bit hot and sweaty. So have a little bit of water Had before we go. And uh, here's a little shout out to Citywood Floors in Hove, the best okay. flooring <laughs> company in Sussex, the okay. ultimate for all your needs, who actually uh, laid uh, your beautiful floor. They did, they did, and they did. look stunning. And so are also not wonderful. sponsoring this vlog. <laughs> no, <laughs> hi to all my buddies at uh, Citywood Floors and Lion Vest Trading. Yeah, it's Cheers. my dad's old company. Really great flooring in the house, which this bookshelf can now sit upon beautifully. Absolutely, oh, it's a perfect so match. We'll get this home <laughs> for Lucy. Hopefully, a successful job. Absolutely amazing. All the way through. Super nice. guys. <laughs> Thank God for sensors. It's like when you're a kid and you're in, well, Cody's little car. Yeah. Ah, okay. Here we go. Next time, we'll, I'll, I'll bring my saws, we'll chop it in half and we'll bring the Range Rover, chat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we made it nearly home. Phew. We're stopping for some essential stop caffeine. Yeah, caffeine injection. I think we've heard Coffee can. Don't worry, that is an old broken porter filter for the coffee machine that we're using as a hammer because I couldn't find my hammer anywhere, just bashing in a couple of the pins. But other than that, we've cleaned it up. Looks super nice. Yeah, solid piece of furniture. So we just need to get it in the house, get it in place, and hopefully Lucy will be a happy girl. Okay, so the big reveal. We are in, it fits, looks really good. It's quite dark in the room, but once we get some ornaments on there, I've kind of put a few bits on there, but no doubt Lucy will rearrange this later on, but it really suits the room for free. Just shows Facebook Marketplace. If you need furniture, if you need anything on there, go ahead and look on Facebook Marketplace first. This was half an hour up the road. They didn't want any money for it. Just gave it a quick clean. I would say that is awesome. a job well done. Superb guys. Sorted. Thanks hey, for your help. Warrington nice removals one. at yes. your service. Yes. <laughs> We're quite used to it because we... Um... Absolutely. <laughs> Here we go. There we go. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we moved the whole... Everything you see here, we moved from our old place with your Volvo Absolutely. and the Range Rover. We didn't hire a removal firm that time. So we're quite used to the furniture removal. So if anyone in the area needs help in hand, give us a shout. We're, we're free Monday to Friday. Incredible combo at your service. Yeah, weekends off though. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, I do still exist even though I have not been here, oh sneak peek behind me, even though I've not been here for any of this video, um, George has just done a video on his own today, or oh, yesterday actually, it's now the next day, and I was out at baby college with Coda in the morning, and then we just did a lot of separate stuff yesterday, so we didn't really see each other that much, which is why George had the camera, which is why I haven't caught up with you guys at all, but yes, now the next day, we're heading off on a little trip today, and that vlog's coming very, very soon. I'm gonna show you the finished result of the bookcase that George and Mark got this mor uh, yesterday morning for us. I'm really happy with it, and I'm even more happy the fact that it was free. Like, someone was just giving this really nice 200 pound bookcase away for free. They've managed to clean it up nicely. You can't really even see the scuffs anymore now that we filled it 
and I'm quite happy with how I've like designed each shelf. I'm really pleased. Um, I think we need to jig it around a bit for Koda's sake because there's some like glass things lower, um, but we're obviously not going to let him near it until we fix that. But let me just show you quickly. So here is the current look. Ignore this, this needs to be fixed onto the wall too. It just looks a bit weird. And we're still sorting a load of other stuff out with the house. But I think everything else in this room, if I pan around, is just so low. There's nothing higher than this. Everything's low. So TV's going on the wall. We're having something cool put on the wall here, which we'll see soon. And then we're going to have some artwork, some more mirrors and stuff. But this is like the first thing higher. It's like nearly touching the ceiling. Um, so we've got some... Coda's little baby books there, some photo albums and candles, a baby scan, a clock, some candles, these little mice thingies that um, Georgie's sister and her boyfriend got George for his birthday, which is so cool. A chessboard from our chess days in lockdown in the Manila. A Marshall amp that used to be owned by a very, very famous person. Um, all of our books just here. Very random selection as well. If you pause that, you'll see the kind of stuff we're into. Very weird. Real massive array of stuff and um, little footprints and handprints that I made George for his birthday. A little tortoise that belonged to my grandma. Um, little glass bars. This has got some remote controls and wires and stuff in. And there's a little light there. So in the evenings, we can pop it on. We had these in Manila, you may remember. And there's just a nice little glow. But I feel like it's really given this room like some character it's not just black and white anymore it's personal to us and it's a bit more homely and a bit more family friendly i suppose um yeah we're literally leaving the house right now george i can just hear he's turned the car on so i need to actually go now why is this in here random tube of kitchen roll um yeah we need to go but all oh, lights still on oh no off there you go we need to go so thank you very much for watching this video if you enjoyed it don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new i've just realized it might have been really dark that whole clip because it was on manual does that look okay? Maybe it's okay. Um, yeah, and we'll see you very soon in the next juicy vlog. Goodbye.